Hello squaddies, how are you doing? I hope you are well. Welcome back to our YouTube channel to another video, to another article with me, Doreen. So buckle up and let's take this ride. Um, the title of this video's article is Prince Harry, Meghan Markle have highs and lows but still remain a strong brand. Oh my god. I have never read a title with so much truth in it. Because this is what, you know, this is what Harry and Meghan, you know, literally are. They are a strong brand. They have been through so much. So many things that could have destroyed them, but they remained strong. You know, they remained together. Yeah, so ooh, I'm so excited to dive into this. So, you know, let's let's read. Um, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle reportedly had a hard year after being branded as biggest losers in 2023. Well, the ones calling them biggest losers in 2023 are just haters guys they're just haters and it is said if you have haters in your life it only proves that you're doing things in the right manner so harry and Meghan are doing things right for themselves um prince harry and Meghan markle are still a strong brand des despite surviving um a hard year with frogmo eviction new york catches divorce rumors and more um i will admit that they have been attacked from all directions you know um whether it's from the royal family you know taking away a gift a gift that they were given by queen elizabeth you know the catches by paparazzis you know people out here attacking their marriage telling them that they won't survive the year you know they have been attacked but these guys have remained strong. And not even forgetting when Omid Scobie's book came out, everyone is claiming that Harry and Meghan wrote the book. Harry and Meghan have to speak. Harry and Meghan do this, do this. There was a lot. You know, I believe they had they had to to fight a lot, especially from the outside. In terms of noise from the outside, they have faced a lot but they have remained strong you know they have remained together you know they they have just been there to support each other to protect their family you know yeah so yes they they have been through a year but they have come out stronger they do ended the year 2023 with one final blow after they were branded as the biggest losers of 2023 by hollywood reporter again look at these people attacking them from the outside they man 2023 people just decided we are gonna attack you because we need to hear something from you but the fact that they remained silent they were like we are not gonna let that noise affect us you know the fact that it didn't drive them to the edge you know, the, the fact that they didn't serve the media with what it wanted. Because I believe the media was like, oh, perhaps we'll get another, you know, we'll get some drama. You know, they expected Harry and Meghan to react in a certain manner, but they didn't serve them that. Um, analyzing the successes body language, expert Darren Stanton said... From an unverbal perspective, we have definitely seen Harry develop a lot emotionally, certainly in the last year. And I'm like, there's this quote that I like, that tough times build character, you know? So perhaps the way people were used to Harry when he was still a royal, that anytime something was said by the media or something was done, you know, he would react, he would, you know, he would run to fight it. But now he has grown emotionally. I believe he has gone to a point where you guys keep talking. I know my truth. You know, let's say for example, him, you know, fighting so many uh, media platforms in the in in the courts. I believe so many stories came out trying to condemn him, you know, trying to make him stop. But he was like, you know what? I know what I'm fighting. I know my truth. I know this and this happened. And that's what I'm fighting. And I won't let you guys distract me from what my goal is. Which is fighting misinformation. Which is bringing back integrity to the media. So yes, I believe from the tough times he has faced. You know, from the time that um, he got into a relationship with Megan. Like, those guys have literally been through, ooh, through hell and back. 
but they have come out stronger they have come out of it with character which is amazing um he is far more willing to speak his mind to be open and honest about how he feels she added look at that and i want you um as we read this statement again because i'm gonna read it it's so it's a beautiful statement think about a boy or a man that was brought up in a system where you are not allowed to freely express yourself you know when you're going to make a speech or just going to the public you are literally given a scripts this is the way you're gonna behave you know this is what you're allowed to say and this is not is this what you're not allowed to say this is a person who has come out of this system literally every move you make is being controlled and now he is far more willing to speak his mind you know whether you guys agree with him or not he's gonna speak his mind he's gonna say what he really thinks about a certain situation he is open and honest about how he feels and we could see this in his books there we could also see this in the statements that were made in court you know you could feel that this guy was being open and honest even though you guys are not gonna agree even though you guys are gonna fight it you know fight his truth um from all corners he was like yeah this is how i honestly feel and this 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 is just so much so, this is so amazing you know because i believe him having this character it even empowers him more in the fight that he is fighting you know the fight of misinformation you know the fight of bringing back integrity to the media this is going to you know to play a big role in that um the expert went on to talk about megan who recently made a comeback post on social media with a video for the um latte company blend stanton said megan remains super confident Ooh. ah man i just love her confidence um however i do feel that she will sometimes try to come across as very happy but it doesn't always seem that way um it's confidence you know when you do things in confidence you leave people wondering how can you be that happy yet abcd is not happening the way it was supposed to happen you know how are you that happy yet people are attacking you from every direction you know but megan she is a confident woman and she is confidently happy and confidently at peace Ooh. um there are times where you can see her frustration shine through whether it is with harry or herself she noted and i'm gonna say just one thing even in frustration she is still confident because she's human isn't she supposed to be frustrated she is allowed to be frustrated because that's a literally normal human emotion um dishing on how megan appears stressed at times she said the couple had some highs and lows but they still remain a strong brand as ever woo harry and megan are still strong you know um when they appear here people will recognize them people will give them the attention people will want to hear what they have to say because i believe together they are very integral people like they just work in integrity and whatever comes out of their you know of their mouths it's i'm gonna say it's full of passion and wisdom so they they are still a very strong brand and i believe 2024 man 2024 has big things in store of them or the brand harry and megan has very big things in store for us um if you introduce a couple together and the world knows them together and then they find themselves in a situation where they need to find their own projects and their own identity there is going to be a strong a lot of speculation but on top of being a couple they are both working on their own things he said they are fully supportive of each other concepts and ideas but they are different from one another they have different meanings oh my god i love that i love that i love that i love that that as a couple if you introduce harry and megan together people know them people recognize them people know that these people have something to say you know 
they're literally a voice together as Harry and Meghan. And it doesn't stop there. When Harry is by himself somewhere, he has a voice as a Harry. You know, and people will give him his attention. When Harry, uh, Megan, sorry, when Megan is somewhere by herself, people will give her, will give her, her, you know, their attention. People will listen because they know Megan has something something to say as herself. Harry has something to say as himself. You know, together they are a power couple, but they have not, you know, lost. Their individuality you know Harry is still Harry Megan is still Megan and they are still Harry and Megan oh before concluding she said everybody understands that they are not just going to stand still you know they are making their moves underneath you know individually together the actual initiatives they are making their moves Oof. I love this article I have loved this article because it's one of the truest articles that articles that we have read you know about who Harry and Meghan are you know as individuals and you know as as a team together you know that they support each other they are there for each other even when Harry is doing his own things for example the Invictus games Meghan is always there to support you know to support him when Meghan is doing things for women Harry is always there supporting him and when they come together you know they are literally there for each other they are empowering each other in that moment so ooh, I honestly can't wait to see what these three parts <laughs> of these brands bring us i can't i can't wait to see what harry you know does in 2024 i can't wait to see what megan does in 2024 and i can't wait to see what harry and megan do in 2024 anyway until the next video bye bye